vlog, I'm taking over for this person over here. This person? Look how short she is. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Cheryl. If you're new, welcome to the C Squad. And if you're a training subscriber, thank you so much for joining me again. Today we are back with another video. A few days ago, I posted my budget with me for April. And to be honest, I kind of noticed that you guys weren't really engaging with it as much and the views have been a little bit low. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm not about chasing views and all that, but I do want to create content that you guys actually enjoy enjoy and want to watch and you guys really liked my reset routine so i figured we could kind of mesh the two together because i really like the budget with me and i think they're super informative and really helpful but i also think a reset routine in general is just really fun so it is the first of may the beginning of a new month and so i'm gonna be doing my monthly budget i'll also be planning my youtube content for may i'll be getting my nails done because this is a state i'm in desperate need of a nail appointment I'll also be setting my goals for the month of May and also taking you guys through my monthly favorites What I've been watching what I've been listening to before we get into it Please like this video and subscribe for more lifestyle and vlog content It really helps me out in the YouTube algorithm and without further ado. Let's get to it I'm actually just gonna get started with my budget routine if you guys want to see how I budget and save my money I do have a video where I go through the process step by step and I also have a free budget template Which will be linked down below So I'm just gonna go and do it quickly and then kind of summarize it at the end gonna go through a few of my transactions and then I'm gonna pick stocks to invest in the first week of April I did quite a bit of shopping I actually checked my spending at the end of the week and I cut myself off I was like you cannot buy anything else because you've already exceeded your shopping budget I made a payment to Beauty Bay for 15 pounds and 20p and that was for this lovely face wash then I also made a payment to Caseify you guys know I love Caseify Stify. I link all my cases down below. I actually bought a case for my MacBook. It hasn't arrived yet, so unfortunately I can't show it to you. I'll show you guys when I get it. I also went ahead and got a screen guard for my new phone. It's literally the most expensive screen guard that they do because it's supposed to look like there's not even a screen guard. Like you can't even see that there's one on it. Then great news for me, I got money from YouTube ads. I earned $100. 106 pounds and 52p obviously this is not an amount i get every month it's not even an amount i get every two months it's nice when it happens then i also made a donation one of my favorite youtubers kendall ray she has a podcast called mal hire they actually shared a case about daniel robinson and his father was on the podcast basically they're just in need of help i made a donation to their gofundme that was 10 us dollars and then last Lastly, a package that actually arrived last night that I was super excited for, super jazzed. The hard drive that I've been using since like the beginning of 2021 is my Lacey hard drive. It is one terabyte. Basically, I'm almost out of storage on there. So I decided to get a new hard drive. So here we are. Look at that. If we do a size comparison, that is the difference. This is one terabyte. This is five. I paid £857.58. If you guys want to check out my equipment that I use for YouTube as well as my podcast I will link down below my Amazon shop You can also get a six month free trial of Amazon Prime Which means you get unlimited one day delivery you get access to Prime Video Which has some really good shows by the way Prime Music So if you're a student you can get a six month free trial If you're not a student I do have a link for a 30 day free trial So a quick summary of the month I did pretty okay Obviously a lot 
lot better since I got money I wasn't expecting. My overall goal at the moment is actually to get one share in NASDAQ 100, but that is very pricey. It is 258 pounds. It's not exactly in price range. So at the moment, I'm just kind of investing into other stock and then as those go up, I'll sell a bit of those for more money than I got them. So now we're gonna go ahead and plan out my content for May. This is my Notion setup. So I'm gonna hide all of my video ideas. Basically, this is kind of like my setup. This is where all my YouTube video ideas go. Got some ideas for shorts, vlogs. Then I'm just kind of gonna pick what speaks to me, put it in like a schedule format. I'm also gonna plan out the days that I want to film and edit and also script videos. guys i've been at this for like an hour i genuinely didn't think it was gonna take me this long honestly i don't know what direction to take my content in at the moment so i'm doing like a lot of research shout out to youtube because they've added a really cool feature so there's a new tab here called research and so basically i can type in a term and then i can kind of see what are the top searches and then here i can see what you guys have searched they really are special on you i'm so sorry so i'm pretty much going through my idea list that i showed you guys and then kind of typing it in and seeing if the search volume is high and if it's a topic that people are interested in but let me leave now because this cannot be a thing back and i'm so excited about the set check it out they're absolutely stunning and yes i had to get it from all angles but anyway let's just work on my weekly to do's on my home page i have my weekly to do's obviously we're on sunday i've kind of like planned my content done my nail appointment i need to script a video that i'm filming tomorrow let's just kind of delete that and set it up for this coming week i do have a meeting tomorrow i want to do i do my weekly mind and money plan I'll actually be doing that today with you guys, so I'll just move that there. Oh wait, I lied. My meeting actually got pushed to Tuesday, and it's from 2 to 3 now. And then on Thursday, I am so excited about this. We are going to see the new Doctor Strange movie. I am so excited. I love me some Doctor Strange. I am filming a video tomorrow, but otherwise, I think this is how it's going to be looking for now. I will probably get like other meetings added, and I'll probably film something else during the week. That is a very tiny little sneak peek into my Notion. If you guys do want a Notion setup and tour and my Notion template, then comment down below. So now I'm actually going to go into my mind and money planner. If you guys have watched the budget with me, then you know. I do have this linked down below, so check it out if you want one for yourself. I'm just going to go through, see what my goals were for the last month, and if I completed them, then set goals for the this month. Okay, so I've written my goals. I just wanted to show you guys this month's quote. Consistency is more than talent ever will. And guys, if that's one thing I need to be, it's consistent. But anyway, my goals. So a personal goal of mine is to do healthy habits every day. I have in the last week been really trying to get into the habit of having my room clean, making sure I do my bed every day, using my vitamin D lamp because it is spring. And and yet the sun is missing. I need to take my supplements consistently. For work, I really want to post four to six videos. That includes shorts. So I'd really love to get a video up every Sunday and post two shorts. And then as far as financial goals, I have my goal every month, which is always to save the same amount of money. So I want to save X amount of money by the end of the month. And I also want to put X amount of money into investments. And then is there a good habit I want to build this month? And that would be keeping my room clean. I've realized when my room is clean, even if it's just like me doing my bed, clearing up my desk, opening my blinds, letting fresh air in, I feel like my day is so much better and so much more productive. I should actually put here also sitting at my desk 
for at least two hours, I think. I kind of struggle sitting at my desk. When I wrote my trick, I literally had a desk in my room and I spent the whole time studying. Literally the whole of my trick, I studied on my bed. And I know that's like not the healthiest thing, but it's just a habit that I've picked up. So it's been kind of hard to try and shift that habit. So I feel like if I start off by just being like, hey, in the morning after you've made your coffee and stuff, sit at your desk for at least two hours. And then after that, you can sit on your bed and edit. So that's it for my monthly goals. And then I just wanted to do some monthly favorites because I love getting recommendations from other YouTubers. So I just thought this would be a fun time to let you guys know what I've been enjoying in April. And there's gonna be stuff that like pretty much covers the whole year since this is our first monthly reset. So guys, I got hooked on The Ultimatum, Marry or Move On on Netflix. That show is insane. I binged it in two days. It's amazing. It's wild. It's messy. It's drama. And I love it and I'm waiting for season two. And then a movie that I really didn't think I was gonna like was actually Cheaper by the Dozen, the reboot on Disney+. Plus. I'm not a fan of any reboot really, but I was genuinely surprised by this one. I'm a huge fan of the original movie with Steve Martin. I've watched that so many times and I really wasn't expecting to like this one, but I really did. Then as far as music, now this is like a little bit older. This is like music from like last year that I just never mentioned, but I've been listening to it for the last couple of months. Scenic Drive by Khalid. It just gives me my 90s R&B vibes, which is like what I need in my life. I've also been obsessed with Kiana Lede's Kiki. Oh my gosh, that album is actually my vibe. It's amazing. The songs, the lyrics, the everything. I listened to the deluxe version. My favorite track is Cancelled. So if you're gonna listen to one song, that's the one I'll listen to. That is the end of my May reset routine. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you prefer this kind of vlog style video over the budget with me just like let me know just give me some feedback I need to know are we liking the vibes do you want to do something different add in something take something out I don't know just let me know thank you so much for watching be sure to like comment and subscribe to join the C squad and hit that notification bell to be notified when I upload new videos I will see you guys in my next one bye